Imagine reversing time, where the universe contracts. Now, what if we trace this reversal back to the very beginning of time itself? What if our understanding of the cosmos, encompassing its age, expansion, and existence, is only a partial truth? Could the universe be twice as old as our calculations indicate? These audacious questions emerge from a compelling new study proposing that the universe might not be 13.8 billion years old, but potentially up to 26.7 billion years old. This daring assertion challenges the foundational principles of cosmology that have held sway for years. Renowned astrophysicist Neil deGrasse Tyson emphasizes the necessity for groundbreaking ideas to undergo rigorous empirical examination before gaining scientific acceptance. When you test an idea in various ways, involve others in the process, and obtain consistent results, a new understanding of the universe emerges. This understanding becomes embedded in a deeper comprehension of the universe, acknowledging that our previous understanding was only a fraction of a larger whole. Our exploration of the cosmos is rooted in an unending quest for knowledge, driven by skepticism and curiosity. The notion of reevaluating the age of the universe is not new, as the history of cosmology has seen radical revisions. In the 1920s, Edwin Hubble suggested the universe's age was a mere 2 billion years. Although methods have since evolved, the idea of doubling the universe's age represents a significant departure from conventional wisdom. A fascinating avenue for reconsideration involves black hole singularities. According to Einstein's general relativity, black holes necessitate singularities, points of infinite density challenging our understanding of physics. The mystery of black hole singularities could potentially illuminate the universe's birth, providing insights into its early stages. Efforts are underway to address the singularity problem, acknowledging the limitations of Einstein's equations at these extremes. The Big Bang, a crucial concept, prompts questions about whether it is part of something larger. Merging quantum physics and general relativity leads to the concept of a multiverse, birthing an infinite array of universes. This complex interplay of theories prompts us to reconsider the age of the multiverse itself. However, the foundational idea of the universe having a beginning 14 billion years ago, marked by the cosmic microwave background, remains intact. The theory of cosmic inflation emerges as a potent concept to shed light on these mysteries. It proposes a rapid, exponential expansion of the universe shortly after the Big Bang, potentially stretching its age beyond the conventional 13.8 billion years. Since the occurrence of the Big Bang, there exists a finite distance that can be observed because light has a finite speed. As a result, we are highly confident that galaxies exist far beyond our observable horizon. Yet the light from these galaxies has not had sufficient time to reach us. A theory known as eternal inflation posits the intriguing idea of an infinite number of bubble universes, with our observable universe being just one among potentially countless others. This perspective suggests that the laws of nature within each bubble universe could vary. However, the inflation theory is not without its controversies. While it aids in explaining various cosmological observations, concrete evidence of inflation remains elusive. The prospect of uncovering the imprints of this monumental cosmic event may lie in future gravitational wave detectors or more detailed mappings of the cosmic microwave background. For approximately two decades, the scientific consensus has held that our universe is around 13.8 billion years old. Nevertheless, Evidence from the advanced ages of certain stars and the substantial masses of early galaxies has prompted skepticism. A recent study from the University of Ottawa introduces a fresh perspective, leveraging the theory of tired light and fluctuating constants to propose a considerably older universe 26.7 billion years to be precise. Extending the age of the universe could potentially shed light on various cosmic mysteries including anomalies detected by NASA's James Webb Space Telescope. Methuselah, an ancient star, intriguingly appears to predate the universe itself, challenging the seemingly impossible. Similar discrepancies are observed in at least six galaxies, as revealed by the JWST. However, revolutionary theories, no matter how groundbreaking, necessitate empirical validation. As emphasized by Tyson, a plethora of evidence, 
ranging from the clarity of distant galaxies to the time dilation of cosmic events and the consistency of fundamental constants on Earth, consistently points to a universe approximately 13.8 billion years old. The concept of the universe's age, rounded to 14 billion years, is termed deep time. Remarkably, the recognition of such vast time spans is a relatively recent development, emerging only in the last 150 years. Consider the historical perspective of civilization and its evolving understanding of time. A challenge arises from the misconception that cosmic time intervals somehow correlate with human time intervals, an assumption that doesn't hold. Notably, the universe has spent the majority of its existence without our solar system, slowly synthesizing heavy elements from light elements, a process that transpired within the first three minutes. All right, so you kickstarted the process by producing hydrogen, and then came the formation of stars. As we transitioned from the Dark Ages, the James Webb Space Telescope took center stage, finally attuned to examine the conclusion of the Dark Ages in the early universe, a period marked by the presence of matter and energy but devoid of stars. These materials eventually coalesced into galaxies, eventually producing a sufficient quantity of heavy elements essential for crafting planets. Planets, known for their abundance of heavy elements, are formed in the cores of stars. This intricate process unfolds over time, and we, as a second, third generation star system that birthed the Sun, witness the ongoing birth of stars today. This phenomenon is observed by peering deep into gas clouds. When these newly formed stars harbor planets in their orbits, those planets are composed of the heavy elements that emerged later. Considering the theory proposing a universe with an age of 26.7 billion years, it introduces compelling solutions to cosmological challenges and finds its place within the realm of speculative multiverse theories. However, the prevailing body of evidence currently leans toward the widely accepted notion that the universe's age hovers around 13.8 billion years. Consequently, based on our present understanding and the evidence available, the likelihood of our universe being 26.7 billion years old remains highly improbable. Nonetheless, the field of science is in a constant state of evolution, flourishing through the interrogation of established concepts and venturing into uncharted territories. Consequently, even though we currently work with the most advanced models and theories at our disposal, the trajectory of cosmological research holds the potential to astonish us with groundbreaking discoveries in the future.